Alright, hey y'all, what is up and welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a hot freaking minute since I have uploaded anything, so I'm back today. Yay, holy applause. I'm just kidding, oh my god. <laughs> but I'm back today with a current household update because I do have a speed build coming hopefully by the end of this week or early this weekend explaining my life update and where I've been. As most of you know, if you've been keeping up with me on social media, you know that I I have been on a hiatus if you didn't you can just look at my recent uploads it's been about four months since i've uploaded had no intentions of it taking this long but it was necessary it was much needed and y'all i'm doing great i'm happy life has took a complete turn for the better for me so yeah so i have been trying to rack my brain about what I'm going to do when it comes to my upload schedule because I am back. I plan on continuing uploading, maybe not every single day, but definitely at least three times during the week until I get like a steady schedule going. I will explain my situation in the speed build so you guys can kind of understand. So with that being said, I am going to have to pull the plug on some of my let's plays i'm gonna have to put some of them on hold i kind of already have an idea so i'm just gonna go ahead and run that by y'all real quick and please 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 if you've been watching any of my videos in the past leave your input on what you want to see stick around i know that the sims 2 let's play is very very popular and something unique to my channel i do want to keep that around but for some reason i'm having computer problems <laughs> i'll explain that later i'm not going to get into all that today but anyways um it's, it's not really working out right now playing the sims 2 hopefully i can have that fixed soon but for right now it may just be strictly sims 4 because that's what's running the best on my computer right now so Anyways, <laughs> I'm going to be keeping um, the Runaway Teen Challenge going because I'm still in love with Mercy and her story. I'm not ready to see that end yet. I still have a lot to tell with that, so that will be coming up soon. Stay tuned for, you know, the Runaway Teen Challenge. And then I'm going to be putting on hold the Torres Legacy, which I know most of you love the Torres family. It's the family I started my channel with but I'm in between the third generation right now and I do have a big story I want to tell with Palmer so I want to build up to that and I want to work on that so for a little bit until I kind of get my head on straight and the schedule you know YouTube thing back going I'm gonna put a hold on that so I hope y'all don't mind um what else um my seasons let's play that I had planned that I never started I'm just gonna down the drain with that uh, and so i'm just going to be showing y'all a current household because this whole hiatus i haven't even really been playing the sims period i've had so much going on so i'm a little behind you know discovering and learning experience and seasons so i just started a fresh save and little simsy save file shout out to little simsy it's a lifesaver but anyways i'm going to introduce you to my current household now if you like her story and i really like her story i see myself getting attached to the sim as i always do and you want to see me continue her story i can easily just add this in there with the runaway teen challenge and that be two let's plays going on on top of speed build sorry this is a bunch of rambling but i just i need y'all's help trying to figure out what i'm going to do so if you like this family and you want to see more of her then just let me know down below but anyways let me go ahead and introduce you to my current household so this is miss josie timmons and her cat moki she is absolutely she's absolutely precious I, i'm in love with her oh my gosh she's so pretty <laughs> but anyway she lives in san my shoe nose she lives in this cute little apartment i did build this apartment it is on my page in the gallery it's currently winter so she has just decorated for the winter time she's got her little tree up but i really like this apartment i think it's like the perfect size i like the color scheme of it it just reminds me of like fall and winter um, and then through here we have the hallway and then there is the washer and dryer of course and then right here we have a little spare bedroom where Moki's stuff is and then we have her little computer desk and her box of decorations and then next door we have her bedroom which oh my god I love her bedroom the lights are off sorry <laughs> but I just think that's so cute I'm obsessed with these new beds like I said I'm still you know discovering everything there is with seasons and um, i'm loving it <laughs> but anyways here is the little bathroom but yeah that is her apartment 
So a little bit about Josie. Josie is a young adult and she doesn't have much of a family. Actually growing up, she was kind of bouncing around from foster home to foster home. And so with that being said, she always loved to read. She's a bookworm. So let's look at her traits real quick. She's a bookworm. She's good. She's got the home turf and she is family oriented. So with her upbringing, just kind of being like pushed around from um, home to home, she always, you know, went to books for comfort, and she loved to read, and she loved to escape, you know, her reality just by, you know, diving into a book, and just being a part of that person's world and that person's story, so, yeah, she's always been a major bookworm, and she always knew that she wanted to be a writer one day, she aspired to be an author, she wanted to be that escape for other people she wanted to use her imagination and her you know experience in life and all of that to you know, aspire other people and you know help them escape so when she was in high school she actually ended up working at a bookstore and she met a famous author and he actually took her in taught her a few things and set her up for when she graduated he was like hey why don't you come be my writing assistant out in see my shoe no i know you know affordable apartment you can afford and so that's what she did and she's actually been killing it she's gotten two um promotions since she's been here everybody is wanting to hang out with her and i'm thinking that we are going to go to the humor and hijinks festival i know she's a little bit tired um i don't have the the draggable whatever mod because I think it was like messed up or something so I had to take it out I need to get the updated one um but let's go ahead and change her outfit shall we these are her outfits oh my gosh she's so stylish she's so cute y'all oh my god okay so we're just gonna go ahead and go with this okay sorry if that transition was really bad I'm at work and <laughs> my mom comes knocking on the door of my office want to come in and chat <laughs> so anyways we are here with Josie and she is at the humor and hijinks festival this is her everyday wear one of her everyday wear as you can see she's very stylish she's very cute I'm so excited for freaking winter and fall I know I'm a little bit behind on the excitement with seasons but Oh, sweaters and boots. I'm living for it. I'm ready for it. So anyways, mm, it's pretty cold, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, cold, but not freezing, so not bad. Okay, so anyways, I want to win some money because, like, eventually I do want to get a house for her. So let's just go ahead and join the jokesters. Um, her relationships, as far as that goes, um, she has, you know, acquaintance relationships with some of little simsies uh townies they're familiar to any of you who play in her save file like parker christopher mindy vince edna all of them um but she doesn't have any romances or anything um i haven't found anybody yet you know i'm just i'm going with the flow i'm not rushing into things and neither is she but like i said she does want to own a house one day and i you know what once I started playing in the apartment, I was kind of like, oh, you know what, I should have gotten her a house so I could experience the fullness of seasons and, you know, had her into gardening and all that fun stuff. But I don't know, it just kind of made sense with her story to start her off in an apartment and just see where she grows from here. So, yeah, she's talking to uh, Penny Pizzazz. Okay, well, let's go ahead and just tell some jokes to Penny because we're trying to win some $500 uh, to help us out in the future. Um, let's see if there's anybody here that, um, stands out to us. You know, any, any future lovers here? Some prospects here? <laughs> I have actually put a few good-looking, uh, men in here. I have not, you know, ran across them yet. You know how that is? You, you plop them in and then you don't want to force it. Like, you don't want to, like, go over to their house and that's just a little bit too forward. So, you just hope you run into them. That's what we're doing. <laughs> Um, Parker Shay, there's a rumor going around that a crazy party is happening at the Shatlet right now. Care to join me? Um, I think we're going to take him up on that offer because, uh, it's not popping around here. We, yeah, we're, we're, no, no such luck. All right, so let's bounce. Forget making the $500. We'll get a promotion. It's cool. All right, so let's go ahead and go with Parker and see what's going on there, who we can mingle with, and see if we can, uh, um, find somebody, you know? Oh my gosh, look at the details. Oh my gosh, the, the, 
the fog, the smoke or whatever coming out of her mouth. That is so cool. Like I said, sorry if you see me randomly like ooh and ah over like certain things that come with seasons. I haven't experienced it yet. This is the first day of winter. It's my first time experiencing winter. So, ooh, Lenny. Hey, he's, um, yep, he's cute. Let's come over here in friendly introduction. Um, why do I always do this? Let's come over here in friendly introduction. Let's introduce ourselves. Uh, Naoki. You know, these townies aren't bad looking. They just have names that I can't pronounce. Like the random generated, you know, townies. <laughs> Hopefully some more people come. We have, um, who's this? Sierra Blake. She's very pretty. I've always thought she was very pretty. Um, this might be a little bit more dead than, uh, where I was at. Tabitha Rowe. He ditched the, uh, <laughs> the Humor and Hijinks Festival too. Who is this? Roger Crane, um, I don't know what I'm going to do. I really want her to bump into these, these, these guys. I made them just for her. <laughs> She's not having any luck, but whatever. We're just going to go with the flow. We're in no rush. She just moved here. She's just lingering. But, oh my gosh, he is cute for real. He is one of little Cindy's townies. Uh, he is in the Rock and Rollers, which is a bowling club, y'all know. But he is very freaking good looking. Let's ask him if he's single. Let's just go ahead. She's feeling playful. She's feeling confident. Power of the jokesters. Even though she's not there anymore, she's feeling good vibes. So let's just have her go off of it. Okay, so he's single. All right, I feel you. So am I. Good to know. Let's make a flirtatious joke. Well, you know, let's just go for it. <laughs> I'm getting choked. Oh. Wow. Okay, she's getting really tired, though, so we're probably not going to stay here. Ooh, okay. He's feeling it. Okay. I'm liking it. I'm digging it. Okay. Um, let's just continue to flirt with him. Maybe, like, exchange numbers with him. We're just chatting him up. Um, who's this? Javier. He's an adult. Might be a little bit too old for us. Actually, I think he's married, so maybe not. Let's not be a homewrecker. Um, I don't know. I really like want to exchange numbers with him, make it a little bit realistic. Tabitha girl, I know them shoulders, them shoulders are a little frosty, ain't they? Okay, um, let's compliment his appearance, you know, you're the best looking Sam I've seen since I've been here, you hear me? I mean, Don Lothario is pretty good looking, she's met Don, but I mean, it's Don. You know, we're not going to be basic. You know, Josie, we're not. We're not being basic. We're not going. Um, we're not hooking up with Don Lothario. We're just not. Let's ask him about his favorite author, you know? Uh, we're distracting him. We're majorly distracting him. My bad. <laughs> Alright, so anyways. Um, yeah, let's leave him to it. He's got a line of people. They're all wanting a drink. And they're just staring at her like, girl, can you please? Please. So let's have her just come over here and watch the DJ. Leave him alone. <laughs> Johnny says, yeah, seriously. Okay, it is popping a little bit more than what it was, though, so I'm not going to complain too much. Let's introduce ourselves to Sierra Blake. She's, like, so pretty, and she's really cool. I like her tattoos. I like her style. Let's, you know, she's not really Josie's type, like, someone that she'd be friends with. Because she's more, you know, she's well, she's outgoing, but she's she's not a little bit. She's got you know a little rebellious streak to her, you know. Looking at her, just you know, doesn't look somebody she'd be friends with. But you know what? Opposites attract, and sometimes that can be like the best friend, you know. So let's just go ahead and introduce ourselves to her. Um, ask about her day. I know she lives not too far from us. I think in the apartment next to us. So you know, we could easily, you know go over and visit her start hanging out with her a little bit more um but yeah i don't know guys i think we're probably about to just go ahead and wrap it up and send her on home and put her to bed and we're just gonna call this uh a day we're gonna call this a part here part one um like i said if y'all are interested and a little bit more of Josie and seeing where her story goes, seeing if she finds love, if she becomes a famous author, all of that. Please let me know because, you know what, I love her. <laughs> and I would love to continue her story if it's something you are interested in. But, you know, yeah, let's just go ahead and get her home real quick before we wrap it up.
Hakeem. Y'all don't know Hakeem, but Hakeem was our bartender. I thought was really cute. Oh, he disappeared. I was going to say hey to Hakeem, <laughs> but he was our bartender the other day. And when I was playing, you know, on my own, he was super cute. The interesting. Fancy him showing up here. But anyway, she's super exhausted, so she's going to go on to bed. Here's our bedroom in all of its glory with the lights on. I love the color scheme. Let me just go ahead. Oh, dang it. <laughs> I was going to show y'all every every little detail. Oh, there we go. Well, I was going to say the lights are off, but Moki to the rescue. But look, I just, I really like it. It's different. I, I'm proud of it. I think it looks really good, <laughs> if I do say so myself. But anyways, like I said, if you like this apartment, it is on the gallery. Um, it, do, it does not include any custom content, but it's not going to look exactly like this. Um, I did add that bed, of course, and the washer and dryer and some other things. This bedroom, I think, was originally a toddler room. Um, but of course, you know, I changed it up a little bit, but the same layout, same principle, everything is still the same. If you want to go ahead and follow me on the gallery, keep up with my speed bills, apartments, and all of that. But anyways, with that being said, I'm going to wrap this part up here. We're going to let Josie get some sleep. I'm probably about to go head on over to Mercy and the Teen Runaway Challenge and start recording that. I miss her. I miss her story. I miss you guys so freaking much. I'm so excited to be back. Thank you so much for the support and the love and it really means a lot. Um, I have lost some subscribers since I've been gone, which is, you know, it's okay. I'm not worried about it. I got my faithful ones. Y'all are so sweet. Y'all always checking up on me, making me feel loved. And I just, I love this community so freaking much. Like, I don't even know how I feel so close and connected to people that I don't even know. We just love the sim. So, thank you so much again. I'm glad to be back. Just hang with me on this upload schedule. And stay tuned for, you know, the Runaway Teen Challenge and a speed build updating you on my life. So, get ready. Go ahead. Plan on grabbing you some snacks for that. I'm sure I'm going to try to build something kind of big because I got a lot of tea to spill so anyways guys thank you so much for watching thank you so much for sticking around if you like this video you want to see more of Josie leave it in the comments down below leave your suggestions opinions all of that and if you want to subscribe and see what's coming to this channel be sure to do so and I will see y'all next time I'm feeling tired Stick